to welcome you back to Black Sight. And tonight, we're going to talk about Nicki Minaj's husband was innocent. Alleged victim admits to lying. First, I would like for you to subscribe to this channel. Hit that like button. Hit that notification button. But also, comment on this video. This is from MediaTakeout.com. Nicki Minaj's husband, Kenneth Petty, a music industry insider, has been all over the news lately over a ex assault conviction from 20 years ago. Now, Media Takeout has learned that a secret video was leaked appearing to show the alleged victim admitting to lying about what happened many years ago. In the video, the victim claims that she asked the prosecutors to drop the case against then the teenage Kenneth, who was represented by an outmatched legal aid attorney. The explosive video was leaked by a friend of the victim, Jennifer Huff. Jennifer's friend secretly recorded a phone conversation between the two, where Jennifer discussed Nikki's husband's case, asking the prosecutors to drop the case against Kenneth. In the video, Jennifer can be heard saying, I stood up in court when the judge asked, does anyone have anything to say before Kenneth Petty is sentenced? And I say, Your Honor, I am the person who pressed the charges, and I would like to drop the charges. I made a huge mistake. Jennifer continued in court in front of Kenneth's friends and family, and the judge was like, Take it to the DA. But according to the district attorney who was not interested in dropping the charges against Kenneth, she told her friend nobody was trying to hear that s now we're going to listen to the video right here Anything to I say before he is sentenced? I stood up and I said, Your Honor, I'm, I'm, said, Your Your Honor, Honor, I'm the person who pressed the charges. I would like, like to drop the charges. I made a huge mistake. This was a in court, in front of his family, in front of friends, in front of everybody. Whatever. They was like, Take it to the DA. Nobody wanted to hear shit. Because he probably didn't have a paid lawyer at that time. I don't know how much good comes from that. I don't know how much I'm good saying, I'm saying that'll be like a low I'm saying that'll be like a low offer of other people. You know what I'm saying? Me me thinking how I think about like, shit. That'll be a good like that'll be a good a good faith with with niggas don't a you good don't even gotta do faith with, with niggas don't you, you just heard the video of the young lady. This young man, Kenneth Petty, has been taking flack. For 20 years about a crime he never committed a crime that the young lady asked the DA to drop the charges can you imagine having a s assault on your record and you never committed that crime Nikki has been fighting ever since she got back with him to clear his name and Nikki has taken a lot of flack. Now it seems like she and her husband has been vindicated. He is now was charged in California, was sentenced because he moved there and didn't notify the proper authorities you gotta do all of, of his crimes in the past. But now we have video proof with the young lady's words, Jennifer Huff's words, saying that he did not commit the crime. And she asked them to drop the charges. And the DA wasn't hearing it. He was just another black male that they could put in the prison system and mark his name. That he would never have a decent life because once you get that S A by your name, you go on that list and your life will never be the same. This is why Nikki was fighting because I believe that Nikki actually knew the truth about what happened. 
So how can this man get back his good name? If I was him, I would go back since they have this video. Go back to the judge and ask them, can you open this case back up? Bring that young lady in front of the court again. Let her hear this video and ask her would she like to recant what she said. And if she says yes, Kenneth Petty's name should be clear. And I don't know if he wants to sue her or sue the court system, but he should have that opportunity to do that. Because this brother has taken a lot of incoming fire. People saying he's no good. How many people can walk around having that scarlet letter on them. At least Nikki was fighting for her man. I have a lot more respect for Nikki Minaj today than I had before I read this article because she stood by Kenneth Petty in his innocence when most people were throwing daggers at him. This should be enough to exonerate Kenneth Petty. He's an innocent man. She said it out of her mouth. That's all you need. She's not getting paid. She said this to another young lady. Yes, in privacy. I don't think she ever wanted this to get out. But this is a recording that can be used by her. And you see how the legal system is. He had a legal aid attorney who probably didn't give a damn. He was just another black male. I'm getting my 70 grand a year, so what? But Kenneth Petty has the right to be exonerated for a crime he did not commit. You heard her say that she wanted to drop the case. That's all I need to hear. I want to thank you for listening to Black Sight. I hope you subscribe to this channel. Smash that like button, but also share this video.